Infectious mononucleosis, aka mono, aka the kissing disease, is a common viral disease caused by the Epstein-Barr virus. Mono most commonly affects teens and young adults. Symptoms of the virus include swollen glands, fever, sore throat, overwhelming fatigue that makes you want to sleep for days, and generally feeling like shit. The virus is typically transmitted by saliva, which is why it's often called the kissing disease, but it can also be spread by sharing cups, toothbrushes, or anything else someone stupid decided to put their mouth on. The virus first infects the DNA of epithelial cells in the throat, then beta lymphocytes, a type of white blood cell. This causes a change in appearance of the lymphocytes under a microscope, causing them to have visibly large and irregular nuclei. Because mono is caused by a virus, which is not alive and therefore can't be killed by antibiotics, the only way to get better is to wait it out. Doctors recommend rest, lots of fluid, and plenty of binge watching your favorite shows on Netflix. Sometimes they will give you a steroid shot to make you feel a little better. The downside of this is you start thinking that you can resume normal activity. And when you do, your spleen swells to an unholy size and you end up not leaving bed for five days. Working out and playing sports is not recommended for four months after being infected. Unfortunate news for athletes and people who are doing really well on their New Year's resolution to go to the gym five times a week. No school, no work, no gym, just bed. Eventually, when your fever goes down, your glands return to normal size, and your cabin fever becomes too much to bear, you can return to your normal activities, albeit a bit slower than you were before. But good news, the virus stays in your body forever, so you'll always have the chance to infect someone else in the future.